Here we are at the entrance to my apartment. There's that bright yellow tree that's changing color. And uh, this is a typical, at least from what I've seen so far, older setup where you have a courtyard, a gated courtyard, I should say, and a bunch of apartments. And some of these are pretty slick. I've seen the doors open. The outside is very scruffy, old, and uh, nondescript. A little bit of a shock when I got here. And my landlord lives right where this air conditioner is, and I live next door. So they are the nicest, sweetest people, and they'll do anything to make me happy. They're very kind. And that's the most important thing, because in these tumultuous times, you know, rents have doubled and tripled, and people have leases, and landlord tears them up and says, this is the new rent, if you don't like it, you can go, and so on and so forth. So here's my entrance. A little kitchen dining area. The omnipresent pomegranates, which we'll get to later, and little kitchen area. We've got a bushamel going on the go here with some cauliflower and cheese. Uh, tiny little toilet. The sink's about as big as my hand spread out. Shower, that's it. Little fridge. And then there's a bedroom off to the side here. So this is just fine and it's warm and comfortable. The strange uh, sofa configuration is due to the fact that I wire up my smartphone to the TV so I can look at uh, Netflix and so on on TV. So uh, the, this this runs almost $600. I think it's 580 something when I do the conversion. And uh, that's a lot of money, probably double what it was worth a year ago, but uh, that includes everything. So heat, gas, electricity, water, and uh, the owner comes in, cleans the place spotless once a week, takes my laundry away and washes it and irons it all for that price. So I can't complain, I guess, all things considered. Pretty good spot. Very basic. Um, Everything works, everything's just fine. It's the quietest place you could possibly want to live in. There you go.